When we talk about a natural IVF, people, patients tend to think that these are completely natural. So cases in which we do not give any single injection, we do not give hormones, and the patients proceed with the natural cycle and they only take the injection that is going to trigger the ovulation and proceed with the collection. But in most of the cases, this is not like that. Like that. Uh, the, the groups who usually perform natural IVF, they use very low doses of, of uh, hormones for a few days just to make the follicle grow in the right conditions. The protocol is not going to be like a normal IVF, but the idea is that they start with a natural cycle and then on day four, five, there are a few, few injections given of uh, either FSH or AMH, M MG to help to boost the, 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 the growing of the, of the follicle and then they stop it. The follicle continues growing and when the follicle reaches between 18, 20 millimeters, then they take the last injection, the HEG, and they proceed with the collection. Uh, which is usually done without any uh, sedation, any anesthesia, because you only have to go for one follicle. So that's something that the patients can usually handle very well without needing to be on a surgery in an operation uh, room. But uh, again, uh, so don't think the natural cycle means no hormones at all. You usually are going to take a very low doses for a few days, but that's it. And of course, the last injection to trigger the ovulation.